Bomb threat. All right. Bomb threat outside Fox 45. False alarm. It was just a toilet. I put that toilet in front of Fox 45 because of the corruption in the courts. The money that Fox 45 pays Ivan Bates. All right. Sinclair Broadcasting. You feel me? Atlas Restaurants. That's Fox 45, 2007. David Smith. David Smith got a lot of politicians in his pocket. He paid a lot of politicians. You got a, that side of corruption stays alive. This is the Baltimore Cent Dissent Decree, First Amendment. Protected activities, all right? That means that I can put toilets all over the city. It's legal. Potty training politicians. That toilet was a, a prop for a movie, Letters Design. And if you bring that toilet to court, or have supposed to have a court date, Ivan Bates squashed that. Because Ivan Bates getting paid by Sinclair Broadcasting. That's David Smith. Letters Design. So I'm sending letters out. Knowingly following a false police report. Ivan Bates can't protect you. Denial of due process and equal protection. That's the FBI, Lord Baltimore. All right. Activism is on trial. All right. Whistleblower. Corruption in the courts. Ivan Bates shielding the corruption. Denial of equal protections. All right. That's Nicole Porter, the Department of Justice. That's Anthony Barksdale, Mayor's De Deputy Mayor, Holiday Street. All right. That's the executive director in the Center of Criminal Justice Reform, University of Baltimore Law. That's Jared Jimenez. We talk about voter suppression. ex felons got a right to vote. And we talk about voter suppression by the Democratic and the Republican Party. Yeah, we're going to bring it all to light. Everything that he got, he got to bring to a court. That's the Maryland Volunteer Lawyers for the Arts. That's Senator Ben Cardins. That's Kwai Sanfume. That's Dana Moore, and she got plenty of evidence. And this is the Department of Justice, United States Marshals. Like I said, Ivan Bates, we talking about the dissent decree and violating the dissent decree with David Smith.